I'm wondering, Pep, if you can just sort of, I mean, it's, um, it's depressing to hear all these different things which are happening. I mean, how much of this kind of is, is a surprisingly worse scenario than what you were expecting, say, five or 10 years ago? Or how much was, was it sort of foreseen? Um, are you shocked by what you, by, by what you're seeing? So, so the answer is no. I mean, literally, if you look at 30 years ago, the kind of projections we were doing through the IPCC, they're largely round spot. You know, again, we provide uncertainties. You know, I just mentioned that we're maybe a little on the higher end of those, of those, of those trajectories. But the thing, what's different is that when we say climate extremes will increase by, you know, 30% or intensity of a heat wave will increase by, you know, it's very difficult to make sense out of it. You know, at a personal level, I mean, how do you make sense of those graphs and those percentages? Now what has changed is that two-thirds of the world population has personally experienced massive climate events that they had not experienced in their own life, whether they were a 15-year-old boy or a girl or a 75-year-old man. Uh, so, you know, we are experiencing things that th they're completely out of the records uh, in our, you know, kind of the last 200-year records. And that's what's really changing very rapidly, that more and more people kind of realize what climate change is and we're no longer talking or looking at those figures. We are just basically experiencing very personally those heat waves, those floodings in ways that, that we have not seen before.